Hey, hey, what's up, everybody? Wanted to bring an update uh, to you guys out there on the MP15 MOE edition. This is the uh, MP1522. I'm sure you've seen it in my other videos. I went ahead and changed it up a little bit. I took the accessories that I had on my uh, Sig 5 uh, 22 off off the Sig, and I put them. I went ahead and put them on the on the AR on the MP1522 here, and I actually like it better. I'm gonna go ahead and, and keep these on the MMP15. I just wanted to give you guys, let you guys uh, see how it looks, and uh, maybe if you're interested in setting your going, your gun up, your your MMP, kind of like this one is. It's up to you. Um, this is my taste. I, I like the way I have it set up, and I'll just go over go over it with you guys real quick as far as what I ended up putting on it. Um, as you can, as you all know, that it comes with the backup sights already. You got the rear, and then you got the one on the front. <clears throat> what I went ahead and did was I added my uh, mini red dot, my Bushnell TRS-25 on top of the UTG 3 slot 1 inch riser which I got that from Amazon. I'm sure everybody's seen that video. Very good very good package right here. I went ahead and put that on there. So I'm running that. And then I went ahead and put on the front of the on the front here, I'm going to walk around. As you can see I have a Phoenix TK-12 light which is Right around 50 bucks for that light, and this mount right here, um, it was only about it was between eight and ten bucks on Amazon, so it's pretty cheap um, as far as the setup goes. But I really like it. It's, it's, uh, yeah. A lot of people are kind of are setting their ARs up, and as far as with this configuration, a lot of people like that right now. That look, and it looks great. Uh, I mean, I like the way it looks. I love the mini red dots, opposed to the big giant red dot, especially for the for just the plinking 22. I think that's a, a perfect combination. And then the light, I don't like, I'm not going to go out and spend a gazillion dollars on a Surefire for my 22. This setup right here works for me. It's about 60 bucks just for this little setup. So I thought that was a pretty good price. And uh, it's, again, it's, it's, it's less is more in some cases. And I think that's kind of how, you know, I, I, I see it. Um, not too much going on, but not too little. I still have the front vert grip here on my backup sites if I want those. So... Um, just a quick update of what I'm what I've done to the MP1522 MOE edition. I'm probably gonna keep it like this. I like the way it looks. I think it looks good. Um, it feels better than when I had the accessories on the Sig. I just like the way it feels better. On the Sig, I didn't have the actual. I didn't run the light because I didn't have one yet. Um, so I just got this light, and again, I, I, it fits perfect inside this uh, inside this light mount I got off of Amazon.com. So. So far, so good. Um, I'm still gonna post videos of it, of me shooting it. Just haven't had a chance. This has been really busy. Just got back uh, from California, so um, check, uh, look for those. But yeah, here we go. MP1522 MOA edition with the accessories added. Thanks for checking out the video.